guys, it is Thursday and I uh, just got home from work and um, I was just about to, I was gonna make a protein pancake. I can't decide if I want one, I should have one. Sometimes I'm like not hungry so I don't wanna eat but then, like if I don't eat now and then 30 minutes I'm gonna be starving and then I'm gonna be pissed. Um, I find myself doing that a lot, I don't know if you guys do that. So just be careful because Sometimes, you know, you'll skip your meal and then you end up like going nuts and being starving and it like kind of ruins everything. So try to stay on the timing because once your body gets used to that, your metabolism will kind of wake up. But that, that happens for me at least. Um, but I was going to make a protein pancake. I'm also going to cut up a t-shirt that I got. Um, I'll let the dogs out. Edwina's cousin uh, started a like fitness company, uh, fitness shirts and t-shirts and um, he wants to do like apparel and stuff like that. And um, he's working with a company called Big Swole. So it's called I Must Prosper Athletic Clothing. You guys have seen me wear some of the shirts. Anyways, he's just trying out some shirts and just trying to find kind of the right formula. But um, he gave me one of these shirts and he, he was like not really sure about it, but I kind of love it. It's Popeye. <laughs> Um, and it just says Big Swole on it. I, I love it. And I don't normally go for, like, red, but I just I just really like it. So I thought I would cut it up and then just show you guys me cutting it up because I don't have a lot of time. And I just wanted to show you how fast um, you can just kind of quickly cut up a t-shirt. So i to, of course, let the animals out again. <sighs> so funny. I'm forever getting frustrated with them, and I love them so much. Hi, Sashi. Oh, you guys want food too. Oh my God, I fed the dogs, but I didn't feed the cats. Get mad at me. I know, I hear you. Okay, there we go. Show you guys. So I just cut it from there to there. And then all I'm gonna do is fold it over To match the other side. That's basically how I do it. Of course with two hands it's a lot easier. Okay so as you can see I have like a perfect like tracing tool and then I'm just going to basically take the cutters and trace it. Easy enough, right? So there I have it. And then if you want to take it a step further, let me set it up the back. So as you can see, I just set the t-shirt up on the back and then he has his logo on the back. So I will just make sure to cut underneath it. And we'll just do like some slices across. So I'll just take the cutters again and then I'll just slice across And I won't take this one all the way down. I think maybe we'll try, try that. Let's see what that looks like. You know, and then I just do some of them, and then later I can always go in and do more of them. Um, and all I did was pull. So, you know, you can take it all the way down if you wanted to. Let me see if I do that. Okay, and there you have it. I went all the way down on that one. So, let's, let's focus here. There we go. I went down on, on that one and um, didn't do anything else in the front. So let's see what it looks like. All right, so these are the leggings that I was telling you guys about. And they just have a high waist. As you can see, they like almost come to my belly button. And then there's like a little pocket um, right in the front. These are a size small um, and they fit really nice. I feel like they're a good size. And then um, the back just says never settle. 
And I will say though, like, if you do like a squat, there is some sheerness to the fabric. So if you're worried about that, I'd maybe go a size up. Um, so they're not as like stretching. I'm not gonna do legs today, so. Um, and then this is my big swole shirt that I cut up. And this is a size small. Of course, I don't have like a long torso. I feel like they look better on Edwina because I got like short short to torso issues here. But this is the back that I cut up. And oops, it's like slanted. Anyways, this is the back. And yeah. I, oh my god, I think I cut it like slanted, which is actually kind of cute. You can always fix that too by going in and like cutting some more. I guess I could just pull it. Anyways. So, yeah. And then I'm just wearing my Nike fly knits and my leg hurts really bad. And I gotta pick up my hair. So. Anyways, that is what I'm wearing to the gym. Maybe the shirt is crooked. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Oh well. Alright guys, I am... Oh god, the sun. The sun! Um, I'm at Raw Fitness right now, so I'm gonna go inside. My belly hurts. I think I sucked down the HD whatever too fast. Today is one of those days where I don't feel like working out. I don't know what it is. I think I'm just tired. I'm like anxious or something. Something, something ain't right. <laughs> something is not right. I don't know. I'm just, I have all these things I want to do and get done and I'm anxious about it. And it's like, I can't do them fast enough and work is, um, I'm very busy right now at work. So anyways. I gotta pee. Maybe, maybe that's the problem. Okay, there's a tree next to my car. I'm gonna move my car because it's gonna like, look at, I'll show you guys. It's like scratching my window. Yeah, I'm gonna move my car really quick.
right, we have a first time jump roper, Alethea, trying out the TKO jump rope. It's kind of nice though. Oh, right? It's like you're doing it. Yes! It's really light or something. There's something about it that works really well. <laughs> Alright guys, it's proof. This jump rope is amazing. Alethea can't jump rope, so this is like, this is good. <laughs> All right, guys, just got home. I'm gonna do some broccoli slaw, about a cup of this, and um, kind of feel like having chicken tonight. So I'm just gonna grab my chicken that I've already cooked. So yeah, it was good today. I was tired today. I could tell in my workout, I just, wasn't feeling it. I swear it's it's like on and off every day. It's just how it is for me. Anyways, let me um let me prep this. You guys remember these things I got from Ikea? This is what I use them for. Okay, close up everything. Anyways, so we'll do that. We'll do about five ounces of chicken. I'll go ahead and weigh it on my scale that I always use. ounces of chicken. And I'm just going to throw it in there and I'll cut it up later. And we will make, um, add a little bit of this uh, coconut aminos, just like a teaspoon. And a little bit of water. that summer. All right, and there it is. I'm just going to add some of this chili garlic sauce to it. I have this uh, Alpha PhD. I've like cut out a lot of sugar week and um it's like fruit punch. It's really good. Alrighty. I'm going back. Hi guys. Happy Wednesday. It is Wednesday. <laughs> Um, and I'm at City Athletic Club. I'm getting ready to go do some boxing. I swear this is the, there'll be a third time I've done it. And I feel like I have to like psych myself out to do it. <sighs> I think it's just cause I have like a pain in my leg and I hate like being a quitter or doing something different than everybody else is doing. But it's gonna have to happen because there's certain things I just can't do with my freaking injuries. Um, anyways, I'm about to go inside. Hopefully the guys in there are a little bit nicer. I love this place, but some of the guys in the front are just, I don't get, I don't get the douchey, like, I don't know, just so rude. We were just asking a few questions and the guy was just so rude to us. It made me not want to like, oh, anyways, just me venting. I normally, I don't like to talk bad about people, like, I mean, that's not what YouTube is for, but it's life <laughs> and, and this is my life. I was all excited about joining the gym and then the guys were rude. I had this uh, Alpha PhD. I've like cut out a lot of sugar in the past week, and um, it's like fruit punch. <laughs> it's really good.